Hello and welcome to Afro Entertainment. If you are watching my video for the first time, you are very much welcome. Please kindly subscribe to my channel and share my videos. If you are a returning subscriber, I very much appreciate. Please click on the notification bell to get the latest videos. Thank you. According to an EFF Twitter account and a video shared on Twitter handle, residents of a particular community are crying out to EFF for help, disclosing that the Economic Freedom Fighters political party remains their last and only hope. They lamented that the continuous lockdown imposed by the government made them to lose their jobs. They are now beckoning on the EFF to fight for them once more. Furthermore, they stated residents of a lockdown in Philippines who lost their jobs due to hard lockdown restrictions are saying that Mbalula Fikile is removing them from their homes. Likewise, they are saying that the EFF has fought for them before and are now asking the EFF to fight for them again, land and jobs manji. The video was just posted on Twitter by members of the Economic Freedom Fighters political party. This video contains some of the pictures. It is unclear why the people are accusing Mr. Fikilem Balula, aka Mr. Fixit, of driving them from their homes. This election period, political parties are shifting from campaigns and manifestos to blame games. They are now blaming each other for the problems in South Africa. The ANC is blaming the Democratic Alliance for not looking after the residents of Shwane and for the poor delivery of service in the municipality. The Democratic Alliance, on the other hand, is blaming the ANC for the poor conditions of the country, the unemployment and the corruption bedvilling the country. The Economic Freedom Fighters political party is labeling the Democratic Alliance a racist political party and they are calling Herman Mashaba's political party a xenophobic political party. The Democratic Alliance also see the Economic Freedom Fighters political party as being xenophobic towards the white people. They also accuse the EFF of promoting a lawless society and a borderless South Africa. Many political parties are not just campaigning with their manifestos, but they are blaming other political parties and then distribute t-shirts as a way to win the hearts of their voters. Nevertheless, people are still surprised or confused why the residents of the town are blaming Mr. Fikile Mbalula for their problems and for removing them from their homes. Furthermore, it should be noted that many communities have allegedly turned their backs on the ANC. A community in Pumalanga could not allow the ANC to campaign as a lady kept shouting and disrupting the Vice President of the Republic of South Africa, David Mabuza. Thanks very much for listening and please do not forget to leave your comments in the comment section.